study, college division one athlete from the University of Washington. He was a rower, low back pain. So show us your toe touch, what it looked like when you first came in. So initially with his first toe touch, he would lock himself into extension and basically use a hip strategy. So in order to get rid of that and the pain associated with it, we used two different strategies. First was a Jefferson curl. So if we give him Jefferson curl with 25 pounds of load as he's going down, he's going to eccentrically load the extensors. This is after we facilitated the inhibited extensors. So when he comes back up, those extensors are already preloaded. So when they go into extension, we got rid of his low back pain coming up out of a toe touch with Jefferson curls. So now what about the low back pain and stiffness going into toe touch? Second strategy was actively facilitating abs as he does his toe touch. So now as he goes down, he's getting a reciprocal inhibition response to the extensors, which are now letting him go down because of reciprocal inhibition. So two different strategies in order to get better motion with two different motions, even though it's the same part of our functional screen. So hopefully you're using those thought processes with your patients, whether they're an elite athlete or an everyday Joe.